So here's what I realized about being isekai. Um, so I, there's no guarantee that when I am, I will be reincarnated into a world of fantasy and sword, swords. You know, there's no guarantee. I may be reincarnated into a world very similar to this one. It will be a better life. I may just need to have skills uh, similar to what I would have to have here in this life. In this life, but I would just need to have a. I would have a better life. I wouldn't have mental illnesses. I would be accepted by society. So I would have to learn how to just adapt to that society, and well, I would have skills to prosper in that society. And so what I need to do is study anime, not just isekai anime, but other anime. The isekai anime would be to study how people use their skills to adapt into isekai anime, but other anime because they show protagonists that have skills they've learned, like in Case Closed, how Kudo Shinichi has learned to be a detective, or how others will be great at programming, or other things. So I need to learn these skills in order to just be able to function better in Iseke worlds. But like I said, there's no guarantee it will be a fantasy world. Maybe a modern world like ours today or maybe a world like ours but in the past as far as just a couple decades earlier. And so my knowledge of modern technology would really come in handy. Um, whether or not I'd be able to take a smartphone to look information up to learn and share technology with them is beyond um, my predictability. So I don't know if I'll be able to take my smartphone with me or anything with me, but I should be able to attain knowledge in order to just help them. Uh, maybe coding, maybe knowledge of how to make things from scratch. But I wish to take my knowledge into the isekai when I am reincarnated.